It wasn't that long ago that there was speculation, rumor flying, that there was going to be a new Harry Potter TV series coming to HBO Max, tentatively titled Max, which is the new rebranding of HBO and the Discovery merger thing. I don't know what's happening. It's, it's a complete disaster. I'm also not a fan of this Harry Potter series. Let's talk about it. In a press release today, it was uttered that there would be a decades long, a decade spanning, which is 10 years for those that are stupid, a uh, TV series following all the Harry Potter books. There are, I believe, seven books and there was eight movies because they cash grabbed the last one. But I love the Harry Potter movies. I'm a big fan of them. I'm not a big fan of this news. It's way too soon to do something so so ridiculous. I understand book purists want to get more bang for their book, and they're probably gonna get that with what I would assume are gonna be hour long episodes, hour plus maybe, we'll see. That doesn't necessarily mean they're still gonna follow the books to a T. I thought the movies did a bang up job. Yeah, they took out key ingredients, they, they swapped some character arcs here and there, they looked over stupid Peeves the Ghost. I never liked Peeves the Ghost, but if you're peeved about that, you're probably gonna get him in the TV series. They are recasting Harry, Hermione, Ron, the whole, the whole gang. I'm worried about this because those movies were such a love letter to not only the books, but to, to film in general, to cinema. You had top tier actors, a lot of which are dead now, which is very depressing to think about. When I watch those movies, I'm like, and he's dead, and she's gone, and he's on his way out. It's not fun. It's not fun in that respect, but everything else is magic, baby. Everything else is just top of the line from the cinematography to the beautiful score to the amazing castle, Hogwarts. Everything about it was just knocked out of the park. So to scale it down and claim that you're still going to do the books justice, I just, I kind of balk at it, <laughs> is what I say. <laughs> Good luck. Good luck getting that kind of quality and that kind of acting. I'm not saying it's impossible, Kim. It's very Kim Possible, but I just have a hard time believing it. I also think that quantity over quality can play a factor. Sometimes less, most of the time, less is more. So those hour and a half, well, I don't think any of them hour and a half, those two hours to two and a half hour movies may seem rushed at times. They may seem to be sidestepping some plot points, but man, they, they are very tight films all around. So this news is not tickling me the right way in my swimsuit area. Quite the contrary. It's like being punched in the nuts. And I'm not the kind of guy that likes that. Here's the bottom line. This type of announcement on a film property that wasn't that long ago. It wasn't that far back when the last Harry Potter movie came out. Is the equivalent to me of them rebooting Star Wars. The OG trilogy like 10 to 15 years after the originals came out. They still haven't rebooted those, and they probably never will because they're untouchable. I, it's kind of like Indiana Jones or Lord of the Rings. You don't, wanna, you don't wanna mess with that. Instead, you do like a crappy Rings of Power spin-off. And that's kind of hoping what they were gonna do here. There's so many stories you could tell. There's all these different magical schools. Why are we so stuck on Hogwarts? Because we have source material? whoop de doo Make new material. There was a damn fine game that came out, Hogwarts Legacy. It takes place at Hogwarts, but it's about an entirely different storyline, different characters. It's very well done. Why not just take that and make it the show? I have a lot of concerns, is the bottom line. I want to know what you think, though. Let me know in the comments. Are you excited about this? You, you happy that you can get another... Maybe you didn't like the movies, and that's, that's fair. That's fine. They're not for everyone. So you're happy for a fresh start, a do-over. I just don't think it's going to work. I don't, I don't think so. And, and to kind of maintain it for 10 years, which is the plan, each season is going to have a book to its name or more, apparently. That's tough to maintain those actors, to keep that story quality good. The, the cinematography, the music, everything has to fall into place for this all to work out. And I just, I don't see it. I don't see it. Let me know, like the video, subscribe, all that crap. And hopefully, I'll catch you next time.